Morgan Farmhouse. Welcome back, everyone. Toxic here. Also, you know, we've got Deuce Canoe with us. And today we are playing no. Phasmophobia. This is going to be our first, not our first run through, but this is our first time playing this. So I'm hoping y'all enjoy this. Our first run through. Deuce Canoe died. I did, and I ditched him after that. I did take a picture of his body, though. He got insurance. Five dollars, man. A whole five dollars. A whole five dollars. <laughs> all right, so... All right, we're going to do... We're going to have to do Tanglewood Street again until we get a little bit more money, get us a thermometer, and go to the, uh, the next place, pretty much. So, all right. I'm ready when you're ready. I'm ready. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, no shit. Dude, I got a hint that it says running isn't always the best option. <laughs> keep your sanity. Mine says keep your sanity high by staying in the light. <laughs> I, uh, I mean, that's a good tip. Yeah, that's a very good tip. Very good tip. Hey, it's like, hey, you lead because you have a higher sanity. Oh, I died. <laughs> It got to you first. <laughs> All right, so now we just got to wait on him to load in. Okay, so I, I wish I would have been recording on our first run. It was actually really good. It was an Oni that got it, got him, and thing was being very stubborn. Like, we could not get the thing to talk in the spirit box for nothing. Could not get it to write in the spirit book. I mean, we just took a guess on it being an Ani. The only thing we got on it was like an EMF 5. And, like, by the time that we pretty much got everything figured out, right. our sanity was already dropped, like, super, super low. So, okay, so our options. All right. Maria Martinez. Okay, so we know they got another Latina ghost that's probably going to kill us again. Oh, God. <laughs> okay, so, okay, so we can actually pretty much get all of these objectives if possible. So we got to, you know, of course, discover what type of ghost we're dealing with, capture a photo of dirty water in a sink. So try to listen out for the sinks or kind of like keep a check on the sinks or whatever for water um capture a photo of the ghost which is i thought i did that a while ago because when it first popped up dude like i started snapping a photo and like i got an actual and i actually got another photo of you standing in that corner when it was coming at you or whatever so i, I thought that would have actually you know it would have worked with that but like it did not get a photo of the ghost you know and the next thing you know, you were running towards me and you're like, oh God, he got me. Oh God, he got me. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, I'm dead. <laughs> All right, and then find evidence, evidence of the paranormal with an EMF reader. Okay, so obviously the first thing is going to be an EMF. All right, so back in this little grinky dink house again. Of course, we're probably going to have to do this house a few times until it's done. All right. All right, I got the video camera, and I've got the EMF. All right, you've got the spirit book and the little thing. All righty. So let's go. Uh, here we go. Where am hey, I? Uh, what's this camcorder for? Um, that's just an that's, that's just that other camera. Like pretty much once I found out where the ghost is. Uh, well, no, I've got the video camera. That's just like a regular digital camera there to take pictures with. You know, and the little five on the edge of the screen means okay. we can only take five photos. So we got to get a picture of dirty water and try to capture a picture of the ghost. So. Uh, yeah, well, that, that's fine. I'll try to do that. You, we just got to figure out where this thing is first. So far, both of these have been like in the same general area. The hallway in that first bedroom there. Dude, you got that flashlight on behind me and I see my shadow kind of cast on these bookshelves and it's kind of scared me a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so. Oh, 
Oh, when you go to open the doors, by the way, you actually click and hold and then push. No wonder you can't ever open the doors. Oh. <laughs> no wonder I couldn't open anything. Okay, so the power box is down here. All right, sweet. So, oh, of course it's in the attic. All right, I got the EMF reader out. Um, what did I say her name was? Something other Martinez or some shit like that? Something. That helps out a lot. Okay. I've got a key. I've got a key. Alright. Um, let's see. Let me go ahead and check this room with the EMF. Alright. Uh, I'm definitely need to run out. Damn, I, I did I forgot what the the name of the the name of the ghost was. Uh, uh, Dude, what did Did you Hey the the car alarm just went off. Oh man, what'd you do that for? I didn't. What do you mean you didn't? I mean I didn't. Did you try to like open the door? Ooh, hey, no, freeze. No. no, no, freezing temperatures. Freezing temperatures. I can see my breath. Look at your breath. Oh shit, yeah. Yep, freezing temperatures in here. Hey, let's get out of here. Uh, no, no. All right, it's so, in here. Yeah, all right. I'm marking it. I'm marking it in my journal. All right, our first one was freezing temperatures. All right. Yeah. Oh, lights flickering on and off. Uh, oh, check the switches. Check the switches. Um, I got to figure out a place to set up the camera or something. Check the door to. Okay, I've got a camera set up. Um, your book, the book, the the, the book. You've got the book. All right, I'm gonna set it on top of the door. Hang on. Oh shit! I see it. I see it. It's right oh, there. Oh, dude, I don't have the camera with me. Oh, fuck. And we need to go. Oh, look. Fingerprints. Fingerprints. Second evidence. Oh, there's fingerprints. There's fingerprints. Okay. Can we go? Come on. Let's go. Wait. Is the lights... Okay, I need to turn... The breaker back on real quick before we go out. Jesus, that car alarm is very annoying. Hey, I've also got a digital camera set up. I've also got the uh, the video. I'm at the video camera set up. All right, we're good to go. We can go outside now. Okay, so we know where the ghost is. All right, we've got freezing temperatures. We've got um, what was it? Uh, fingerprints. Okay. Alright, so I believe I've got the camera on. Oh, man. Okay, so what... You we'll, don't have it on, do you? Uh, yes, but the light's on in the garage. Okay, uh, what do you got on you? Do you got the spirit box on you? Uh... uh Alright, you know what? Just, just stay right here real quick. Okay. 
I'm gonna go I'm gonna go turn the light off in the garage. I'll keep a look. I mean, I just turned it off. I just turned the lights off. Oh, those lights that are flickering—that's from the—that's from the car. Oh, okay. Dude, that is a terrible position on that camera. I'm not even gonna lie about it. Like that trash can lid that it is sitting on is like jacking up the whole little scenery or whatever. Um, All right, did you happen to look at the book while you was in there? Uh, no, I'm not actually seeing any kind of orbs kind of flying around anywhere because usually they're kind of every, you know, it's kind of everywhere. So let's let's just watch it for a second and, you know, just kind of keep a close eye look. See if we see anything. I mean, if we, if, if you should, there shouldn't be a reason why you shouldn't. Um, I mean, we've got two out of three evidence so far. Um, we've also got one of the objectives already done. Uh, so we've got to get a capture photo of dirty water in a sink, and we've also got a capture photo of the ghost, which is I've got a picture. I've got a, I've got a, I've got to did the camera on me, so we should be able to get a picture of it if it appears again. So if you do see it, let me know. That way, you know I can actually spin around or whatever and try to get a quick picture of it. Um, I'm not seeing anything though on the camera about a ghost orb or anything. So um, it's I haven't I haven't seen any orbs. Um, let me let me let's let's just check the journal real quick. Okay, so we've got wraith or banshee. So spirit box, either wraith. Nothing on. Okay, so there's not going to be a ghost orb. So to be no ghost writing. Um Okay, so it's it's got to be spirit box or EMF. Okay, didn't you already try the EMF? All right, I do have an EMF meter in there. So the thing is, though, it's got to be level five. See, on here, it just says find evidence, you know, of the paranormal with an EMF reader. So if it just picks up, like, two dots or whatever, that's going to automatically go away. So... I'm, I'm going with the Wraith. Um, I'm going with the Wraith. Okay. Because I, you've already had the EMF in there. Well, it got the level four. Now, it did go to level four, not level five. So, if the EMF, we go in there and it shows up and the EMF actually shows level 5, then, okay, so be it. Um, so, we can go in there. Uh, you got the uh, the box, the spirit box or whatever? Okay. This one? Yep. So, we need to go in to try to use the spirit box. And so, it's either going to be spirit box or EMF 5. It's going to be one or the other. So... If it's EMF five, it's going to be a banshee. If it's going, if it's spirit box, it's going to be wraith. So that's the only evidence yeah. that we have to get, other than taking a photo of the sink, dirty water in a sink or something. So let's go. Uh, actually, as soon as we walk in the house here, bring your ass, man. Come on, don't be scared. I'm following it. All right, so there's a bathroom right here. I'm going to go ahead and check it. All right, no dirty water in that one. You can hear that damn car alarm, though. Okay, I see nothing in the kitchen. Okay, I'm going to move this camera to a better location.
Look, right here where this little EMF reader was, this is where she was standing at earlier, so... Can you hear us? Alright, I've got the digital camera out too, so... God, I hate that car alarm. Uh, man. Ask it if it can speak to you. Turning my damn light off. What the hell's wrong with you? You seriously turn the light off again? Yup. Uh, hold up. Now keep the, like, set the spirit box, like, throw the spirit, cut the spirit box on and throw it on the hood. Did you do that? No? Damn it. She keeps turning the lights off on us. Of course you died, Justin. Oh, man. Justin died. I mean, I did take a picture of his body. Hopefully get some insurance from it. I ran. Like, all right, so I hid. Oh, dude, our sanity is shot. It's terrible. Okay, let me check that camera. Oh, my God, no. The camera. 
I'm not. Ours, I'm not. Okay, so I, I know it's not going to be the camera anyways. All right, so, I mean, it's EMF 5 or Spirit Box. So it's either going to be a Banshee or a Wraith. You know what? Um, let me let me do a little bit of research on the wraith. What is the wraith? Okay, wraith, wraith, wraith. Here we go. Okay, wraith is one of the most dangerous ghosts you will find. It is also the only known ghost that has the ability of flight and has sometimes been known to travel through walls. Wraiths almost never touch the ground, meaning it can't be tracked by footsteps. Wraiths have a toxic reaction to salt. Okay, um, fingerprints, freezing temperatures, and spirit box. Okay, so but also, let's see what we had. What, we, what was it? Um, was it a banshee? Hold on, wait a minute. I forgot. I forgot what it was. Um, spirit box, MF, um, banshee. Yeah, banshee. Okay, so it was banshee and rain. So what is the banshee? I've got to like look into it and see what we're gonna come up with. A banshee is a natural hunter and will attack anything. It has been known to stalk its prey one at a time until making its kill. A banshee will only target one person at a time. Banshees fear the crucifix and will be less aggressive when and will be less aggressive when near one. Okay, so she's less aggr aggressive near a crucifix. So yeah, my fingerprints are freezing temperatures. Only target one person at a time. Okay, so I'm gonna go with Banshee. Because, I mean, she only did target one person, okay? Like, I mean, I don't know if it's because maybe I was down in the basement, like, trying to cut the lights on at the time that she started honing, and you just happened to be in the room, um, or what. But, I mean, it, it did kind of stalk, you know, us, or whatever. So, I'm going to say, uh, man, I... I didn't see it floating. Okay, so it never touch it never touches the ground, meaning it can't be tracked by foot footsteps. A flight has been on to travel through walls. Okay, so I, I don't know if I, I mean I can't say that I've seen it actually go through a wall because the only time that I've seen it, it was actually standing on the other side of the car. So that kind of makes it a little bit a little bit harder. Okay, um. I'm gonna go with Banshee. Um, if you want to, you can actually, you know, go with Wraith on yours. So make sure you mark your spirit box, and I'll go with uh, the Banshee, and I'll mark EMF level five. One of us is gonna get it, you know. It. So I'm gonna go Banshee. You can go with Wraith like you wanted to originally. So uh, make sure you've got uh, your everything marked down in your book. All right. Um, oh, and I did capture a photo of the ghost. So we've got three. All right, so we have three of the four. Um, I meant two of the four. Um, I did not. I, I didn't see any dirty water in a sink. So, and my sanity is like stupid low. So I'm not going back in the house whatsoever. I, I don't care. Yeah, you know, I'm just gonna call this done. I mean, if we both die, it's a lost loss. I mean, if well, at least if one of us get it, uh, you know, gets it or something. I mean. At least, I mean, we'll get a little, some some money out of it, and yeah, I don't know if you can see. I did take a picture of you all like folded up in the corner, dude. I knew you were dead the instant I walked back in there, man. Like I seen your little light on the floor. All right, all right. So we're wrapping it up. Wish you the best of luck. Oh man, I'm. I don't even know what to say. Oh, please be a banshee. Please be a banshee. Please be a banshee. No, it was a race. Come on. Ah, ha, 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 ha. Did you, you did you actually go with wraith in your book though? Did, like, did you hear everything I said? Yeah, I heard what you were saying. Okay, good, good. I I, 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 I miss. I messaged you and told you it grabbed me from through the wall. Oh, did you? Oh, man. I See, I didn't even... See, I, I didn't get... I didn't get your... Uh, 
I didn't know that you messaged me. Like I didn't hear it go off or whatever. So yeah, I, I missed it, man. Oh, dude, see, dude, like, I, I, what? The light went off, you know. Like someone, and when I hit the switch, like she threw the breaker, and I was like, "Come on, man, seriously, just cut it back on." So like, I went down. As I was going down the stairs, my flashlight started flickering, and I was like, "Oh man, she's honing." Because like when your flashlight or whatever starts flickering or the light starts flickering on and off like that, that means that they're honing. And like so, I, I like I hit the I cut the power. All right. So, anyways, Dish News got to go. Um, that one was actually pretty fun. He, you know, he, he died. I don't not trying to say that's funny or anything, but it was still pretty damn funny. And like, so since you can't hear him when he dies, but he can still hear me, he actually did send me a message and said that it actually got him through the wall. Um, I didn't get the message right away, so of course, you know, I still went with Banshee. He went with Wraith, he got it. You know, kudos to him. Um, <laughs> that was actually pretty fun. That was pretty fun. And I'm actually, we're, we're actually going to play this, you know, quite a bit more. Um, man, yeah, so this is. I'm really, 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 really enjoying this. Okay, so I, I, I want to go ahead and actually purchase another flashlight just for the fact that we do need another flashlight. He doesn't have one, and we do need a thermometer too. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and purchase a thermometer just because it says that we need one for temperatures and stuff like that below 10 degrees. Um, Now I'm. Um, uh, I do want to get some salt. So maybe when he gets back on, I know he's got a little money on him. I may just go ahead and get him to uh, probably pick up some salt, and we'll get some salt. And you know, actually, I think I may try to get him to get a crucifix. Uh, I feel like we really need a crucifix a little bit more because it seems like a lot of our objective is to stop the honing with the crucifix. Um, so I, I kind of figured that it may be better to get a crucifix. Now, if he does have the extra money to kind of wing in the uh, the the salt, um, I figure I think the, I believe the salt would probably help us a little bit. So yeah, I'll speak with him and see. And if he if he's got the money to wing it, we'll get a crucifix, and some salt. You know that. Um, yeah, that that'll definitely help us out a little bit. So anyways, um, I want to thank you guys for being here. I appreciate it very much. Um, if y'all want to see more of this, you know, like, I, I'm, dude, this is awesome. This game is awesome. Uh, man, I'm actually, like, really looking forward to, like, getting up there and getting out there. Um, there is a thing, right? I think we're using the spirit box wrong. So I think kind of, like, off, I'm going to go through the training thing or whatever and just kind of see, you know, like, how to use a spirit box. I'm sorry, hit the mic. Uh, you know, maybe try to see how to uh, use the spirit box because I, I believe I know we use B to like communicate with each other. Um, I believe that I may be using the spirit box wrong. That's why we're not getting anything on the spirit box or anything talking back to us. Uh, so yeah, I kind of do need to look in to that a little bit. Yes, yeah, so, 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 so this is B like local push to talk and then global. Yeah. Maybe it's uh, Elf, you know, because like Elf is your secondary use or whatever, and then right mouse button is to cut it on or whatever. So that is your primary. So maybe Elf. Maybe we get a hold Elf to like talk through the uh, the spirit box or whatever. I'm not real sure. Um, I don't know. I'll, I'll look it up and see. Uh, but so for now. I mean, this is, uh, this is us, and uh, we're gonna we're, we're probably gonna do a little bit of series on this. Um, I, I th he was super stoked about getting it and being able to play. Uh, we finally got him a little PC, uh, a PC setup. Um, I mean, of course, it is a laptop, but still, I mean, it, it's able to run it. He's uh, he's super stoked to play it, and uh, we're gonna be doing probably a little bit of gameplay or whatever. Unfortunately, he does not have a YouTube right now. 
Um, but as soon as we're capable, we're going to try to get him a little. Uh, uh, we're going to try to get him a rig set up and try to get him set up on a get a, get him a YouTube channel set up too. Because he does a lot of videos with me. Uh, I believe he enjoys actually kind of doing the videos with a lot of the horror games. You know, so he you know they, he, he's always in a lot of the horror game videos with me. So maybe we can try to get him set up and we can play a lot of the games together. Um, I mean, we'll still do collaboration like we usually do with him coming over and us recording horror games. Um, anyways, uh, anyway, I hope you guys enjoy this. Uh, I mean, like I said, I, I really did. And if you want to see more of this, I mean, leave a like, you know, share it. You know, subscribe to the channel if you're new to the channel. I mean, there's a lot of other, you know, horror games we play that you're probably going to laugh out of from the jump scares we've had a lot of really good jump scares so uh yeah um i know we're kind of a little late on this game but i haven't bought it because I, I i don't really have any friends to play with you know and uh this i'm all new to the pc stuff and uh also with recording as a as a as a fresh content creator for youtube and but i'm enjoying it i'm having fun with it you know Thanks. Thank you guys for the support for the ones that I do have now. Hopefully, I continue to get more support from other people and we can kind of grow this together. Um, so, yeah, once again, thank you for being here. I appreciate it very much and I hope to see you in the next one.